one of the reasons I think that we hate to offer things or pick up the phone and make a call to somebody who might be a good uh, prospect or a good client for our business is we hate it when people say no. It doesn't feel good. It's a rejection. And part of the problem is that instead of viewing it as a rejection of whatever the offer is, we take it personally as a rejection of ourselves. So I'd like to invite you to look at rejection a different way. I'd like you to look at what you offer to people as something that might or might not be a good fit for those people. In other words, anytime you make an offer or share an idea, look at it as a sorting mechanism. You're sorting people into different categories. For some people, what you do and what you offer and what your gift is, oh, I've been looking for this for so long. Thank you so much. That person's a good fit. Oh, this is something I really need. I'm really, really swamped right now. Can we, can we talk about this in a month or so? That person's a good fit for down the road. Uh, you know, that sounds really interesting. My friend Sally could really use your help. This person's a, a possible referral source. And the person who reacts with no reaction or says no, you've planted a seed. And when you plant a seed, you're planting a seed of future possibility. 